Be thou exalted, O God, above the heavens. Let thy glory be above all the earth. Psalm 57, 5. This is Esther Crown Ministries, the miracle and teaching ministry of Jesus Christ. Listen now to Apostle Tanya as she teaches from the Word of God. Visit us at www.apostletanya.org. Oft times, as I have sat with the Blessed Holy Spirit, studying Joseph's obedience and integrity, I have found I have most admired his protection of our blessed master and his wife, Mary. Some time ago, while delighting in the Father's presence, he brought to my remembrance Joseph and his instructions to him in his divine dream. Thereafter, I began to reflect on the attributes of Joseph's character that reminded me of our Holy Father. I began asking thy Lord, what was it in Joseph's heart that he would choose him to raise his only begotten son. Most faithfully, days later, <laughs> as I sat writing, ever faithful to answer at our hearts, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob spoke his answer in my heart. And this was the answer, everyone. Joseph was obedient, humble, and a meek father to his beloved son in the earth realm. Amen? I most enjoy the passage in the book of Matthew, chapter 2, verse 14, whereby demonstrates to us the faithful steps of Joseph after receiving a warning dream from thy blessed master. Let us read that. When he arose, he took the young child and his mother by night and departed into Egypt. Hallelujah. He was most faithful in his obedience unto the masters. This is the most glorious verse revealing heaven's protection of our Savior and the servant Joseph's assignment with thy Lord. This month, as we honor fathers, I must say I have rich memories of my childhood. And as a young adult that I have visited in my quiet time, Thy blessed Master blessed me with an abundance of love from three grandfathers. Three. <laughs> As I read about Joseph, the Master's father, I can see parts of them. They were all very obedient. Such blessed life I have, have experienced with my maternal and paternal grandfathers and an maternal step-grandfather. 
who loved me as if I were his own. I am most grateful with the extended memories I cherish of my step-grandfather, for he outlived my other grandfathers, and he helped change the trajectory of my life. As for my late father, my dad, he was such a handsome, wise man who was greatly protective of my mother and my three younger siblings and me. We were his only world. Family, as we celebrate fathers this month, let us give a thanks to our blessed father who giveth his children the blessing of natural and spiritual fathers. Bestow your honor unto your spiritual fathers and bestow your honor unto your natural fathers. Be thou exalted, O God, above the heavens.